Now, how can you resize a picture in iMovie on the iPhone? Let's get started. If you're new on this channel, make sure you subscribe so you never miss anything important. Well, inside of the iMovie app, you can start like editing photos as well as videos right in one project. But in order to resize it, make sure you select the image or photo, whatever, and the, the timeline below. And then in the, the top right corner, we have the plus icon with the magnifying glass. So you get to select it and then you can pinch in or out to zoom in on the image, right? You can resize it, you can um, just move it around to show like different parts of the image. So that's pretty useful, right? And you end up with this like better looking shot, right? So that's how it works within iMovie. A lot of people would like to have, for example, a vertical video in here, right? Because we only work with the horizontal one. However, inside of the iMovie, this simply does not exist, right? So if you need that, I recommend you to get and explore some third-party solutions. For example, CapCut is a great video editor where you can as well bring in your photos and videos into a timeline like this, but you can switch to a different aspect ratio, right? Which means that you can be working on a vertical video if you want or a square one, right? And even more features and functions like effects and transitions and all of that is available inside of the app. Keep in mind that there are also some paid features, which in iMovie, it's all free, but it's very limited in iMovie, right? So yeah, it kind of depends on what exactly you need or what your preference is, but at least give it a shot. You can download CapCut for free, right? And you can explore what's available inside. So let me know what you think below. Make sure you subscribe to this channel so you don't miss videos like this one. And I'll talk to you in the next future tutorials.